Thank you, Brent. We are now exactly two weeks from Election Day. Many federal, statewide and local seats are up for grabs. And tonight we continue previewing some of the top races in our hometowns that you care about. WDBJ7 senior reporter Joe DeShiel breaks down the race for the 6th Congressional District. If the Buena Vista Labor Day Parade is a rite of passage for statewide politicians, it's a requirement for candidates in the 6th Congressional District. And this year it's a three-way race, with Republican incumbent Ben Klein seeking re-election and Democrat Ken Mitchell and Independent Robbie Wells challenging the status quo. And I'm proud to have fought for the 6th District of Virginia. Klein has served six years in Congress after representing the area in the Virginia General Assembly for 16. He says his conservative political philosophy is in sync with the people of his district. Well, I'm from this district. Uh, I grew up here. I've been representing in the State House and now in Congress for the past six years. And so uh, those values that I was brought up on are the values I'm fighting for, faith, family, and freedom. And I'm not looking at Republicans, Democrats, Independents. I'm looking at Americans and Virginians. Mitchell lives on the northern end of the 6th District on a small farm in Rockingham County. He served 24 years in the military, including six at the White House under Republican and Democratic presidents. And he's had a diverse private sector career. The Democratic nominee says he's running from the middle. And I've always said that I stand for the common good. I stand in the middle because in the middle, I can reach out to fair-minded Republicans, independents, Democrats. To me, it makes no difference where the good idea comes from, whether it was Republican launched. If it supports the common good, I will support that legislation. The time of serving special interest groups and lobbyists is over. Like Klein, Robbie Wells lives in Botetourt County. He spent 20 years as a high school and college football coach, and he's been a candidate for president in the last three elections. He says running as an independent gives him the best chance to make a difference in Washington. My plan, Eaglenomics, takes the absolute best from the left wing and the right wing, and it brings people together. People have asked me all the time, Robbie, are you left wing or are you right wing? No, I'm neither. I'm the bird that sits in the middle, and we will pull both wings together. All three have run a campaign marathon through a sprawling district and now hope their hard work and the support of six district voters will carry them to Washington. Joe DeShield, WDBJ7.